Easy. With the Sleep Number 360 Smart Bed, you can both adjust your comfort with your Sleep Number setting. Can it really help me fall asleep faster? Yes, by gently warming your feet. Okay, but can it help keep us asleep? It senses your movements and automatically adjusts to keep you effortlessly comfortable. Sleep Number, proven quality sleep is life-changing sleep. Don't miss the final days to save 50% on the Sleep Number 360 Limited Edition Smart Bed, plus special financing on all Smart Beds. It ends Monday. To learn more, go to sleepnumber.com. Special financing subject to credit approval. Minimum monthly payments required. See store for details. Me, 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 but also you. <laughs> the Pharaoh fast forwards his favorite foreign film. Powder donut. <clears throat> okay, what's my line? Uh, the only line I see here on the script is get options based on your budget with the name your price tool from Progressive. Oh man, that's a tongue twister, huh? I'm sorry, I'm gonna need a few more minutes. <clears throat> bulbous walrus. The bulbous walrus. The name your price tool. Only from Progressive. The owl ran afoul of the comatose coxswain. Progressive Casualty Insurance Company and affiliates. Price and coverage match limited by state law. Point one, the Fox, with your News 13 weather forecast. This is a News 13 Epic Weather Update. I'm meteorologist James Hopkins. Lots of sunshine and warm temperatures for your Wednesday afternoon. Winds will be out of the southwest about 10 to 15 miles an hour, and highs across the PD will top out in the low to mid-70s. For tonight, clear and chilly will drop down to the mid-40s. And then for your Thursday, lots of sunshine to start the day. Clouds will build as we go throughout the afternoon as we have a dry cold front moving its way through. Highs only slightly cooler, around 70 but much cooler for your Friday with showers. Be sure to stay tuned to News 13 and this radio partner for coverage you can count on. Now, more of the good stuff. 102.1 The Fox.
Point one the Fox is WMXT FM, Pamplico, Florence, Sumter. Your home for classic hits. A Cumulus Station. Two point one, the Fox. A couple of minutes after drive with Matt Scurry, taking you home on a Wednesday afternoon, middle of a long set. Tom Petty, some Elton John on the way, but first, let's break out the air drums. Here's Phil Collins. One hundred two point one, the Fox.
Welcome to Classic Hits, 102.1, The Fox. She packed my bags last night, pre-flight. Zero hour, 9 a.m. And I'm gonna be high as a kite by then. I miss the earth so much I miss my wife It's lonely out in space On such a timeless flight
your kids In fact, it's cold as hell And there's no one there to raise them If you did Job five days a week. A rocket man. A rocket man. And I think it's gonna be a long, long time. To touch you down brings me round again. The Fox, if you're in front of your speaker, you can have the Fox with you. All you got to do is go to our website, 1021thefox.com. Click on that Listen Live link, then minimize us in the background. Let us play the music while you do the work. Tom Petty and the Heartbreakers now, 102.1 The Fox.
home for classic hits. 102.1 The Fox. Classic hits, 102.1 The Fox Drive with Matt Scurry on a Wednesday afternoon. If I was to ask you who the highest paid player in the NFL is, you would probably guess maybe Patrick Mahomes, you know, Russell Wilson, Ben Roethlisberger, maybe even Tom Brady. All good guesses, and technically they you know, could all be correct, but the answer might end up being a Carolina Panthers offensive tackle named Russell Okung. But it's for reasons that you might not suspect. Russ is a huge proponent of Bitcoin. And a while back, he tried to convince the NFL to pay half of his $13 million salary in Bitcoin. Well, the Panthers balked at that. So Russ took it into his own hands. And every time he got a paycheck, he converted 50% of his checks into Bitcoin. The minute they hit the bank, well, when he was doing this, Bitcoin was down to around 27000 Now it's worth more than 50000 so if he was to cash in, that would make him like one of the wealthiest players or the best paid players in the NFL. That being said, he says he's not going to cash in right now. And on top of that, that being said, I understand absolutely nothing about Bitcoin. I'll, I'll be honest with you. I don't know how it works. I don't understand how people can claim to be wealthy when it's not really money. I, I don't know. It's all above my head. But anyway, he's doing well with it. 
On the way, Logs had got some Brian Adams. The police, Skinner coming up also. That I understand. 102.1. The What's it doing? Designing my new 2021 Nissan Kicks Online in the Kicks Color Studio. I give each a special name. This one's electric blue, orange, red, white. I call-